WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN Friday afternoon, the final Friday of the decade, 2019. Pretty remarkable as we come into 2020. Markets, a little bit of volatility on Friday so far, but hanging on to positive gains right now. S&P's up one point, trading at 32.45. We got the Dow Jones up 65 points, trading 28,687. NASDAQ holding up four points, 9,026. The NASDAQ hitting 9,000 for the first time yesterday. Dollar index with some big time weakness today, off 515 ticks at 97,018. Notes and bonds, a little bit of higher price and lower yield. The gold contract, excuse me, up $3.70 at 1518. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to the charts. We'll start it off with the Dow. Currently trading 28,673. You see the volatility though. We're up in higher territory till about 815. We trade about 100 points lower in the Dow, and now we're right back into the middle of that range. NASDAQ 100, pretty similar action. We actually trade from a high of about 88.42 down to 87.80, currently trading 88.11. S&Ps trade from an all-time high of 32.53, quite a price tag. We go down to a low of 32.38, currently back in the positive at 32.45. Jumping back to the NASDAQ, the NASDAQ, folks, 11 straight positive days. First time that's happened since June of 2009. NASDAQ going for 12 straight days in positive territory. Crude oil, we got inventory numbers at 11 a.m. We see a draw of five plus million barrels, bigger draw than the market expected. You had crude trade a little bit higher on that news, 61.71. We also had natural gas inventories coming out at 10.30 this morning. There's your 10.30 volatility, but natural gas cannot find a bid, 219.67. There's your gold contract trading at 15.17, we'll call it 15.18 as we tick. And what else we have? We'll pull up Euro US dollar, as I mentioned. Dollar weakness, Euro strength, Euro trading 111.73. As we wrap this up, some of the other stocks making moves this morning. How about Apple continuing the gains? Up about a half a percent and Amazon. A little bit of volatility, but holding on to another 1.5% gain. Reached above 1900 briefly at 1896 right now. Stay tuned, folks. We had a bunch of programs early this morning. We're going to replay some of those this afternoon. You got Steve Rhodes, Basil Chapman, Tom O'Brien all coming up this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back and have a great weekend.